Hello everybody and welcome back to Don't Stop, day 10, son of a bitch, we have made it far, which is great. Also, I researched some stuff on the wikia. Now I know that the prehastir, which we have in our base, where we currently aren't, just unlocks more crafting recipes, so it's sort of like an alchemy engine or a science machine. But it's a magic thing, which is great. Also, I know more about Abigail, so if we place Abigail down and kill a monster near it, Abigail will spawn. Mmm. Son of a bitch. So, it's gonna be Abigail's ghost. Um, I, I think it said that it's gonna be minus 50 sanity at the time of happening. But if it's constant minus 50 sanity, that's gonna really make us insane. I think it's just minus 50 when it happens. I really wanna explore that, so... The dogs, actually, when the dogs attack, we wanna be in our base. And boom, like that, Abigail's ghost will hopefully spawn if the Abigail's flower is in, in, uh, down in the ground. Which it should be at that time. So I'll just eat all of these because they're going stale. So there we go. We have full health. Full um, hunger. Full sanity. Everything is full. Which is absolutely fantastic. Let's try to explore the other side of this m small bay here, I guess. And try to see what we can find. Um, it works with pigs, I think. At least it works with spiders. But at the time of uh, fighting the spiders, I didn't know that's how it works. So, eh. Didn't have the flower down, but it should be in the phase where it's ready to spawn Abigail. Uh, if you can't remember, it started very closed. Now, then it opened a bit more, and now it's in the final opened stage. So, if you just get the dogs and have the flower down, we should hopefully see Abigail. That's gonna be interesting. I have no idea what to expect from her. Like, I don't know if he's gonna fight with us or not, or what is what like what's gonna what is it gonna do? Well, I guess we're about to find out those things because the dog should happen very soon. The first pair of dogs should be like in the first 10 days, I think, so... Uh, well, they can't be in the first, like, four... Or was it six? I think day six is the first one when the dogs can happen, so... Yeah, we have went way past that now, so uh, hopefully we can actually... Get some, uh, some dogs. We are finding a lot of good stuff. Carrots, we are finding more berry bushes. This is going really well. I really should pick these up as well. Let's do that. Take these flowers. No, flowers, what? Carrots. Jeez. Yeah, this is a very fruitful land we have entered. Um, obviously, it, it... Oh, God, it's a frog. Frogs are hostile. Oh, son of a bitch, take that. Fuck you, frog. Oh, oh, it's Abigail. Abigail, Abigail is down. Take this. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, fight me, you fucker. There's Abigail, now it's the sands. Hoo -hoo -hoo! That's Abigail. Hoo -hoo -hoo! We have Abigail, is this gonna follow us? Yeah, it is too! <laughs> Son of a bitch. Oh my god, it's Abigail. What is it gonna do? It's going somewhere. It's moving on its own. I don't know what it's trying to achieve here. I'm sure we have a spade. Why is it this fucking hard to find a spade? What? We just, we just used a spade. Oh, it's right there in the ground. Abigail, please follow me. I have no idea what Abigail is gonna do. Is she even gonna follow us? Yep, there she comes. Um, <laughs> well, to say at least, it's interesting. So we took only a 50 sanity hit, which isn't too bad. We can we can definitely cope with that. And if we can find some flowers, we should be pretty, you know, able. To I actually like the fact that when something attacks you, it automatically drops the flower. So I guess the Abigail wasn't ready then when we fought spiders because of the fact that um it didn't drop. Interesting. Oh god, where's the shovel? The fucking shovel. The fucking shovel. There it is. At least she's giving us light, which is nice. And I'm assuming she will most likely fight stuff if we get attacked. Like, they are sisters, you know, they will protect each other probably. Hopefully. <laughs> Let's try to return to base now with, uh, with Abigail on, on our side. We found a lot of stuff. This was a really good haul. Uh, and we pretty much... Well, let's explore this dark area. Well, you know, we found a berry bush. The more you know. Uh, and then it's a bit down. There. Let's take the flower. Try to get our sanity up. Uh, where it was. It's really cool. We have Abigail now. <laughs> uh, what was that sound? I sound like a fucking monkey. That's that's great. Well, now I know I can make a monkey sound. <laughs> that's probably... I don't even know what that sounds like, you know. Because, because obviously, as you guys probably know, you know, whenever you, you know, speak... You sound a certain way, and then you hear, when you hear yourself on a video, you're like, what the fuck? 
that is not how I sound. But obviously, I've been, I've really gotten used to my own voice, voice because I edit my videos like every day. So, as it turns out, I get to listen to my own voice all day, every day, uh, which I'm not necessarily happy about. But that's that's the hard life of me. Um, it's it's not hard. But like, I'm gonna, I guess, while I edit this, I will find out if I sound even close to like a monkey. But in my own ears, that sounded like a monkey. So, <laughs> yay! I guess I don't know. That's really odd. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. We have some more bunnies. Do we have three? We have three bunnies. Ooh, hoo, hoo. These traps are about to break though, which isn't the nest which isn't necessarily the best stuff, but hey. It's fine. Oh yeah, one broke. Abigail is just floating around like, you know, doing his her own stuff. I don't know man. She can do whatever the fuck she wants. She's my sister. I'm I'm not her mother. We're just sisters, you know. She can do whatever the fuck she pleases. Let's cook these rabbits and let's make some meatballs. Some meatballs. Oh yeah. Uh, I think I can make them with carrots, but I think carrots are better food just by themselves. So I will do this instead. Get those berries up, berries up in this. We need to eat. Let's use a meatball. There we go. Oh, we can actually heal ourselves. How much is that? Oh, wow, that's a lot. 217. That was only what? That was only eight. Jesus, math is hard. But the first one, I'm sure, did more than eight. I don't know. Maybe it goes like the more health you have, the less it heals, or something like. We also need to cut this down tomorrow. Otherwise, we are gonna have some tree monsters, and I don't want any tree monsters. So yeah, two meatballs. I think we can make. Oh, we can make two more. Son of a bitch. That's quite a nice thing actually, because we have a lot of berries. It's not a problem. But yeah, this way I like being- Oh, again full moon! What?! Two days row full moon! I don't know if that's normal. Probably. I'm just trying to make things sound cooler. <laughs> I like Abigail though. That's my twin- Oh, you can call her to you when just clicking by her. That's cool! Nope. Nope, he's not- Oh yeah, she is. So I can actually do that. I don't know if that's helpful, because I don't know if she fights, but that's cool. Now we have a ghost. We haven't found Chester, we haven't found the touchstone, so we really need to explore, because if we die, we're just dead. We are absolutely just dead. Now, I, it said that one way to trigger Abigail is to die. But I don't know, because if you die, you die without a touchstone. So I don't know if you then play as Abigail. That would be, I mean, that would be sick. But I don't know if that's how it works, you know. Well, I guess we are not gonna find it out because we sort of know that Abigail the uh, more normal way, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, we are having a lot of berry bushes. I'm liking this quite a bit, actually. Abigail is making some sounds. She's probably trying to communicate. She's like, oh, I'm a ghost. I don't know if you noticed, but I'm a ghost. What am I even... What? 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 Uh, so let's plant all of these. We don't have enough fertilizer for, for all of these, but it, I mean, might as well plant them. There's no reason not to. So, eh. This motherfucker is really annoying me right now. Get the fuck out of my face. Thank you. Thank you. No. Oh my god. Sometimes this planting is really absurd and hard and weird. We have a lot of fucking berry bushes and I am happy with that. I am very pleased with the situation. I am pleased with the berry bush situation. Uh, how much fertilizer did we have? We have uh, 10 more. That's fine. And we have 9 more on the ground. So we're actually going to be very close to getting all of these. We might actually get all of them uh, once we fertilize uh, actually... How many if they left? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So that's 9, I think. Yep, so we can fertilize all of them. But we already have a nice amount of berry bushes, though. I'm very happy with that. Now let's cut down these motherfuckers, because I don't want any tree monsters. Some of them already died, which isn't the greatest. But uh, shit happens, I guess. So day 11. I'm surprised we made it this far. Like, I'm really surprised. Um, I mean, it wasn't really a surprise as I've been lately pretty decent at the game. You know, obviously the, um, the, um, let's try was a complete disaster because I forgot you can make a torch. So, yeah, that's a problem. Um, but, um, other than that, I mean, once I played of cam on my own playthroughs, the best I think I had was day 36, so if you could get around there, it would be really cool. We're almost third way there, though, like, that's, that's the insane thing here. Uh, but if you can find the touchstone, that'd be sick. Uh, because then we sort of have a life insurance, and that would be really nice. So we definitely need to do some exploration. We probably can't do too much today, since it's already, you know, halfway gone. 
the, the you know the the daytime then there's obviously the pretty decently long evening and the night is starting to get longer it was a bit shorter uh, there a few like a day back or so it's so it's getting it's probably starting to be autumn I guess or fall whatever you want to call it it has to be because you know the shorter the night is the most clearly it's summer so yeah that's the thing so it's probably starting to be autumn, which means that winter is coming. Brace yourselves, guys. Winter is actually coming. Uh, and for winter, we need to be ready. Winter is so bitch. Like, winter is a bitch. Holy shit, it's hard to play in the winter. You know, berries don't grow, right? So our only food source will be rabbits. Except if we get, like, a huge, insane amount of berries at, of some weird reason. I mean, we have a lot of those um, bushes. So if we could just sort of store them in. So I think there's a way to store berries so that they don't rot as fast. But it's still gonna be a son of a bitch to uh, go through the winter. Uh, please. Plant. Also, if we could find Chester, that would be insane. We, have to, we would have two followers. That would be really cool. I've actually never found Chester in my Don't Starve career. So I would really like to find Chester. Chester. Can you plant the fucking tree? Oh my god. It sounds like Abigail is like whispering some random stuff to me. I don't like that. I know she's my sister, but still. Oh, it creeps me out a bit. Okay, that's good. There's a lot of trees now growing. Should have a decent enough supply of wood. Which, again, is, is nice to have. So, actually, let's take these. Right, that's the berries. Good. I want to see... Oh, we have... Oh, right, that's the uh, rod from the monster meetle. That's good. Happy about that. Can fertilize three more bushes. Uh, there, that's very nice. So we're only lacking a few. We have again two rabbits. I would like to collect you. And that's again two more meatballs. I won't do it yet though because the meatballs do rot over time. Oh, that broke. Son of a bitch. Do we have six grass? Probably not. No, we have. I think. No, these are the tufts. Ooh, it's a bit of a problem. I think. Uh, we need grass, but um, I won't do that yet. Yeah, we have explored actually. <laughs> Look at this. This is fucking insane. We have actually explored quite a nice amount. So. I think tomorrow, actually we'll end the episode here soon, but uh, the next episode I think we'll go over this area. Yeah, I think we spawned here. Yeah, this is probably where we spawned, and we came down and found our base. But this is where we are going to go tomorrow in the next episode, that's going to be cool. I like the fact that Abigail just gives us light, she's like, here is me, I'm a ghost, I will light up your world. What? Uh, let's add the fuel so we can see some shizzle. Uh, let's eat a meatball, because why the fuck not. So, actually what I wanted to do is... Dress, we're gonna make uh, rabbit earmuffs, right? And that's also what we need to do for the winter. Get those, and also there are these beefalo hat. But the winter hat would be sick. So we need to find beefaloes, and we also need... I think we have, we have tree silk, I think, yes. Son of a bitch, that's tree silk. Um, It's sort of close. The cat cap. I guess there are cats in the game, who would have known? Fashion melon, what? I think there are also... What is the ice cube? Okay. Because I think there are like coats. Breezy West, yeah. Stuff like the Puffy West would be insane. Uh, but we need winter colifant trunk. I have never seen a colifant. We need more silk and we need also the beefalo wool. So yeah. Uh, that's a problem. But there was somewhere here. Is some sort of item. I think like a refrigerator or something between those lines. N no. No. Can make gunpowder the more you know. Lightning rod, no. Save splats, no. No. I'm sure there is somewhere here a way to preserve wood. Wood. Food. Uh, bee box, no. Drying rack. Ice box, this is the one. We need gears and gold. So we have e everything except for gears. I have once found gears. Those are like guarded by Templars or some shit. Um, that's gonna be interesting. But it's the ice box. That's what we essentially want for the winter. Because that would help us give the berries alive a much longer while, which would be really nice. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be... We need to do a lot of exploring. Like, we have just explored the same areas over and over again. But essentially, we need to just find much more stuff. Uh, but yeah. It's gonna be interesting to see how, how hard it is going to be to find these things. Actually, what I will do right now is another chest. Because we have a nice amount of wood right now. I'm really happy with that situation. What is this even? Wooden flooring. Uh, we probably won't need wooden flooring, <laughs> to say the least. I'm gonna just build it sort of over here. Thank you. And here we can put stuff like the niter we don't need you. 
Oh, I had some other stuff I wasn't sure I need. Yeah, you, the grass stuff is gonna go. I mean, sure, we can put the rabbits in. Why the fuck not? I just need to remember to get this out of here so they don't get demolished. The seeds can go. That's good. We're just gonna keep the wood. Wood. I keep complete like all the time. It's wood and food. Those are that's my nemesis. Like those two things, I just can't get around with. Well, that's cool. We have two chests now. I'm really happy about that. We only have one rabbit trap. We need tomorrow go and get a lot more grass. We also need to explore a lot more. It's gonna be interesting. Still no dogs though. This is interesting as well. It's really weird that there aren't any dogs. Hmm. But I'm hoping we can have a game. That's that's really uh, nice. Um, she's probably gonna help us fight stuff. Who knows? But if she is, that's gonna be really cool. Uh, but yeah, if you enjoyed, please be sure to drop a like rating down below. If you have friends who enjoy these sorts of videos, maybe you could share the video with them. That would be highly, highly appreciated. And if you're new around here, um, if you could subscribe, that would be also insanely cool and mean the world to me. So yes, thanks for watching, guys. And as always, remember to stay awesome.